practice 16 is just like practice 15 and 14 we have inclined plane i know that previous one had two inclined planes 16 has three this one and this one obviously are inclined this appears uh, in plane with this part the standard plane uh, but this figure it says that no that uh, that third plane that we are talking about is also inclined and my approach to this problem would be going with part design make this entire block as a cube um, and then take this three part away using using the datum plane method that we experimented in the last one so let's give it a try so i will build a basic rectangle and i think making it centered would benefit me the length would be 60 and the width would be 40 by the way i'm using the newest free cad 0.21 version i just installed it today and that's why this um toolbars shortcuts kind of like you know may not look like the previous ones i'm also still trying to make them the way it was but one thing i notice here today is the polyline it looks different it acts different um so anyway just wanted to throw it out there i want to pad it up by 40 now this plane will have an inclined plane this one and the bottom one so let me take let me put those dots in plane starting from the top one so there will be last time i drew a line um let's try that one here it's definitely not at the midpoint somewhere here and the distance between these two is 10 and distance between these two is also 10 so that's our first sketch and that that gives us this point so i probably won't have to do another sketch here let's try on this one i want to bring that line here so that that will give us something in this line too of this will be in a vertical plane and the distance between these actually this is i think this is equal the distance between this point and this point is 10 from that face so that binds this and then i want to draw another sketch here that will go this way take this point in and this and draw a line in between that should do the trick so we have our all the points now we have to draw the datum plane 
we are still in the part design here's the data plane and I want to select this point this point oh no so I want to select this point and select and select this point so we got that plane fixed up let's take um, let me hide that Maybe I should make those point look bigger. Yeah, that was easier. Let me go make those point look a little bigger. Okay, so we got two planes. Now I have to make another plane in here. So let's make a data plane. Select this point and this point and this point okay so we've got three plans uh, three planes built up we have to cut everything out of this pad i'm gonna rename this pad as base cube and go to part I don't know if part design has a similar thing but we will go with what we have what I know slice apart hide this and then use this slice and this one slice apart and hide that and use this slice and this one slice apart and hide that we don't need these sketches anymore so so here it is here's the object thank you for watching the video i'll see you next time